right to greetings and salutations. My name is Comic Fire, and welcome back for more Mega Man Zero Two. I wanted to say Pokemon Red for a second. I'm like, wait a minute, I haven't even touched that game in God knows how long. Is an LP. <laughs> All right, so today we're going to the train of Neo Arcadia and taking on Panther Flauclaws. In this mission, I'd like you to see supplies. Currently, we're moving a large amount of troops, but we're a little short on supplies. Therefore, we are thinking about assaulting an enemy transport and seizing their supplies. Will you help? Not much of a choice, do I? Yeah, sorry for the uh, lack of audio in the last episode, music-wise and stuff. I had a problem with my headset and messed with some uh, audio settings in Camtasia, and then I forgot to turn on record system audio. <laughs> we confirmed that there are supplies in this transport train. Watch out for obstruction to seize the train. Better hope there are supplies in this transport train. Came all the way here for nothing, not otherwise. Alright, we're gonna put on the ice element chip, which gives our uh, stuff the power of ice. Go figure. Here we get Cyber Elf Emic. You get back here. Damn it all. See, it's gonna happen again. There we go. No one fucks with Mega Man Zero. Three pass, and then that happens, and then he just died. Okay. Yep, this is a train type mission where, you know, we had one of these in the original Mega Man Zero. And there's no time limit like the first one, too, so take your time, explore. There's lots of fun things to do. Health is always nice. Don't want to have to use up all my sub tanks until we get to the boss. Need to build up my sword skill so I can actually charge up the sword. Because that will help immensely. Ow, ass wipe. Oh, I can go down here, though. Jeez, I'm getting my ass kicked here. Oh, that was nice. That wasn't. <laughs> New Cyber Elf. Bereiro. That'll prevent, like, if we fall down a pit and we have that Cyber Elf active, it'll save us. I've never actually used any of the bird type Cyber Elves, so I can't tell you how good they are. In theory, they sound pretty good. Well, we're in pretty good shape. Ha! Wish that could have worked out better, but I'll take what I get. Damn it, all that. Is that a cyber elf I saw down there? It's not. Okay, fine. Kill yourself. I don't care. Oh my god, they're everywhere. Thankfully, we got that. I can't stay alive, I'm dying too much. Thankfully, we can make these guys respawn pretty quickly. One of them is bound to drop some health. I know a good way to fight the boss here without actually having to take any damage whatsoever. Well, not any damage, per se, just drastically de- FUCK! Drastically decrease the amount of damage. Ass why I was talking. Mr. Zero, please listen. Enemy mechanoloids are approaching you. Their mission is to retrieve the supplies. Again, this is... You won't fail if you don't do this, but... You won't get your ass rank. Thankfully, this mission's also really easy, but they don't drop any, uh, like, health or anything, so... Like, don't go... Like, don't die for this. Unless your S rank means that much to you, but... 
I have to use my damn sub tank. No, you don't. Damn it, lost one. Now I'm losing another. Okay. Well, we only lost one. I'm sure one credit supplies wouldn't mean that much to uh, the resistance. Maybe it would. Yay, health. Alright, we're still in a decently good way. Damn you! Ooh, Cyber Elf. That didn't work out nearly as well as I thought it would. Now, if you let it, the uh, Cyber Elf will uh, gently float towards you. So if it's in a place you can't reach, don't worry. We get Clockle. It's an odd name, but... Yeah, Extra Life! And our sub-tanks are full again. We'll sub-tank. I'm gearing up on the end here. I'm gonna put my, uh... Busta. Hey, you! Don't you know this is Master Harpuya's territory? Minion of the Resistance Force! I shall stop you! Now, this boss fight is decently tough if you don't do what I do. Ah, damn it. Do I have the ice chip on? I do. Isn't his weak? I thought his weakness was ice. Maybe I should have built up my Buster a bit. Oh, there we go. Buster shot skill up. There we go. Now we can start hitting his weakness. So basically, if you charge up the shot all the way full, you'll get the elemental properties of that uh, shot. Which is very useful. Like, I don't know if uh, there's any truth to this statement, but I heard the more you use the buster against bosses, the stronger it becomes. I can't say if that's true or not. Seems legit. <laughs> there, I didn't even need safe state abuse there. Ha ha ha! No, I have to kill the boss with the buster. Damn it, that sword is useless. I just wanted to cut him in half. Transfer in progress. Two. One. Transfer. I think that's what she's saying. Excellent. Now we have enough supplies to launch our all at attack. Yeah, you better like that. We get the new thunder chip. And now we're going to probably the... I mean, the mission's simple enough, but, uh, the boss is one of the hardest in the game. Phoenix Magneon. There's no way to exterminate all of Neo Arcadia. The rumor says there's an arms facility and situated about 100 kilometers north of our resistance space. They obviously live in uh, Canada. <laughs> if we were to destroy the power reactor, we'd be able to limit their number of enemy soldiers. Will you do it? We are now ready to transfer! I love Lipton tea, but I drank my last bottle of it last night, and now I have nothing to drink today. I do believe we call that a first world problem. This is also one of my favorite themes in the game. Currently, there are four power reactors in operation. Yay! This is also one of my favorite places to fill up my sub tanks and get energy crystals. See, look at all that. That was good luck, but... Alright, now here's what we gotta do. We gotta... If we wanna get that Cyber Elf, we have to... Too slow. And too low. 
There we go. There, now we get Cyber Elf Stoctus. Yeah, that's the gimmick here. We gotta destroy uh, walls and stuff with it. And we got a new Cyber Elf, uh, Bomb View. Alright. This gave me a few game overs the first time I played the game. Lava. And you gotta be good with uh, dash jumping here. And another thing. If we want to get a really good Cyber Elf, we have to destroy that wall. And I mean really good. Like, this is one of the best Cyber Elves in the game. Ooh, now we can charge up our Z-Saber. Now, I'm trying to get it so, like, I get him on the up slash. Oh, that's not working. I'm just gonna drag him over here and I uh, kamikaze myself. Damn it, that didn't work at all. Come on, a little closer. That worked beautifully. And I mean a really good Cyber Elf. The Cyber Elf will double our HP. Cyber Elf Grandy! Now there's a boss up there, but uh, I don't want to fight it. I never liked it. It was difficult. <coughs> the level's difficult enough as it is, so I'm not going to make it harder for me. Now, there are four power reactors, and they all have different attack patterns. And we need to destroy all four to get through the level. Because the boss will appear when you destroy the fourth one. And here we get Cyber Elf b -Lanch. Mega Man Zero 3 gave me a newfound appreciation for the uh, B-types. They give covering fire. Oh, God almighty, this place. This gave me the rest of my game overs, almost. Like, I spent... I spent a good, uh, three days just trying to figure out this place. The first time I ever played the game. Beating it? Oh, that was a different story. Phoenix Magnion was a bitch. Like, I I'm gonna have a lot of problems fighting him, because I usually need to know where I mapped my damn L button! I think I may have mapped it to V, actually. Okay, now we can't stand there. Or else we're gonna die. But hold on, I can charge my Z Saber now. There, more damage. <sighs> I need to find a good place to heal now. I'm starting to uh, run low on HP. And my hair flies in the breeze. No. It was an accident, and I refused to accept responsibility for it. Okay, oh boy. Now we get to fight these. If you have the ice chip, you can, uh, freeze those, but... Use them to, uh, kind of protect you from those. I don't even know why those are there. Come on, yeah. Come on, Blue Falcon! There's a lot of, uh, energy crystals there, but those tops can't be destroyed. So you're just gonna end up hurting yourself for nothing. Now the balls travel along the floor, so be careful. Hey, when my balls just travel along the floor. Theoretically, the shield boomerang should help out pretty well there. Damn it all to hell. That's not what I meant to do. Did I map it to... I did not. For the life of me, I don't know. So he's gonna be difficult, to say the least. Alright, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use my sub-tank, right? 
I'm gonna use the chain rod. Hop up, let that move. Damn it. Just basically more sub tank. Did that fill the sub tank? No, it didn't do that. I expected it to do that. But <laughs> it does that in a uh, zero three. Dude, I love zero three. That's like my favorite Mega Man game ever now. It didn't take me nearly as long to beat. It's a lot. It's a, quite a sight easier than two. But uh, doesn't mean it's not fun. It's just much easier, which is a good thing. This game needed a difficulty to tone down a bit. I'm gonna try this. <laughs> I love it. It's slow, but I think it's working. Okay, here comes the boss now. This one's a fucking toughie. If you have the Thunder Chip, it's going to make your job a lot easier. I didn't have anything. No sub tanks, no Thunder Chip the first time I fought this thing. I'm amazed I actually beat him. What are you doing here? How dare you fool around in my area? I am Phoenix Magneon! Well, you'll pay for this insult. With my Phoenix Flame! I shall purify your evil mind with my flame! This guy is... a sight and a half. It's because of that damn move! And that one, too. And this one. He's got so many damn moves, and he's hard to predict. Damn it! And he hits you with enemies from the previous Mega Man's uh, games. I don't recognize them all, but I do uh, recognize uh, File, Sigma, and Colonel. I don't know if Sigma was there, actually. I've heard Sigma was there, but I can't say for sure. But I know Vile and Colonel are there for sure. So if you've played uh, earlier Mega Man X games, you'll... Damn it! You don't want to be stuck in the middle of that. So be careful with your attacking. Damn it, I thought I could handle that one. Damn! <laughs> no! I saved into him! right back. Alright, let's try this one again. Come on, buddy. Almost there. Okay, I don't care. Yeah! I am a phoenix. I will be back again and again until you pay for your insult.
The second time, I didn't actually require that much save state abuse. I just, uh... It's a lot careful. We get the flame ship. Mission accomplished. And now we have all three elemental chips. Hmm, there was still a drop of tea in that one. Yum. Thank you very much, Zero. Another concern has been handled thanks to you, and our operations are moving smoothly. I'm now very confident of our success. Alright, we defeated all four of the, uh, first missions. If we talk to him again, we're gonna go to a few special missions, so... In the next episode, we're gonna head on to those. See you guys then. Vaya con Dios.